Hey guys, welcome back to Frigmotion. In today's video, we are going to create an awesome looking text reveal animation inside of After Effects. Not only text, actually you can reveal any object using the same technique. So without wasting any more time, let's jump into the After Effects and let's get started. So first of all, let's create a composition with default settings. You can give it a name you like. Now take the type tool and type a text you like. By the way, you can take anything that you want to reveal. Align the text to the center. Now create a solid layer. Let's call it map. After that, pre compose both layers by one by one. And also make sure to check move all attributes. You can give them proper name for the better understanding. Once you're done with that, open map composition. Then on the map layer, we are going to add an effect called gradient ramp. Change the ramp shape to radial ramp. Then place the black point somewhere like this. Also change the white point position something like this. This is very important part of this technique because your reveal animation will be depending on this black point. Once you're done, let's add another effect called turbulent displace. First change the displacement type to cross displacement. Then change the amount value to 300 and size value to 70. Also change the complexity value to 5. Now we are going to add an expression on the evolution. Hold alt and click on the stopwatch icon to add an expression. Then type time multiplier 100. By doing this it will keep animating over the time. After that let's add an effect called mosaic. Change the horizontal block values to 100 and vertical block values somewhere near 50 to 70. Also check sharp colors. You can get rid of the black patches just by changing the size value. Let's keep the size value 50 for now. Now let's back to the main composition. And on the text composition, we are going to add an effect called gradient wipe. You can hide the map layer for now. Check invert gradient. Also change the gradient layer to map layer. Now if we change the transition completion value, we can see the animation here. So first make the transition completion value 100, then add a keyframe on the first frame. Then go forward to few seconds and change the transition completion value to 0. Now you can see the text animation here. Nice. By changing the softness value, you can get some blending effect here. Let's keep this for now. We can adjust it later if you want. Now let me show you some other effects just by changing the displacement type. With every type, you will get some different results. So make sure to check them all. I am keeping this for now. Alright, let's add some glow effect on the layer. Adjust the glow values according to your need. Now make duplicate of the text layer by pressing Ctrl plus D. Delete the glow effect from the bottom layer and we can hide the top layer for now. Let's add Let's add fill effect on the bottom layer and change the color you like. I am making this into a blue theme so I am taking all the tones of blue for the other layers. So make another copy of the text layer and change the color to a different color. Do the same for the second layer also. Recopy of the text layer is enough for this kind of animation. Now turn on the visibility of the top layer. Select the layer, go to layer style and add stroke. Adjust the stroke width and the color also. Also adjust the glow values. Now once you're done with all of this, just offset the layers by 2 frames. Just like this. Let's change the transition softness value to 0. Make sure to change this on all the layers. Now 
perfect this looks really cool now we can add a solid layer for the background add a gradient ramp effect on it and change the color you like You can add an adjustment layer and apply glow effect on it. Adjust the values a little bit and our main text reveal animation is done. In case if you want to change the overall color of the composition then you can apply tritone effect on it. And here you can change the color tone easily. But I keep this for now. So this is all for today. Please do like the video and subscribe my channel and suggest me in the comment in which topic I should cover in my next videos. So thank you for watching. See you guys in the next video. Till then have fun and stay safe.